Today I wanted to show you my paintball landmine design. It's very simple. It costs about 15 bucks, maybe a little less to make in any hardware store. Uh, I wanted to make my own mines because buying them is just too expensive and they're so easy to make. I don't know why you would anyway. Most of the mines I see online, they just don't look like a landmine should, in my opinion. They got these big goofy knobs sticking out the top. They got straw sticking out of them. They're way too tall, which means you have to dig a deeper hole. And if you bury a lot of landmines like I do, you know the hole is the biggest pain in the butt part of sitting up a landmine. This landmine is just tall enough for the 12 ground to stand up in. It's round. It's round on the bottom. And it's got a flat 4 inch pressure plate. And the paint comes out of the very top of the pressure plate like it should. So you don't have to bury it real deep in the ground. It's very easy to set. Just take the lid off. Got a 12 gram in it. Fill it full of your favorite paint mix. Put the lid back on it. Turn it to latch it. And stick it in the ground. Very simple. Very safe. Covers about a 25 to 30 foot circle. Blows out a big old blast of paint. It's got a latch on it. No threads. Just a simple slot latch. Just goes in there and latches on that bolt. Plenty of room for it to move up and down. And that's it. It's Copeland Paintball 4-inch landmine.